his music career goals, he was like, we have five, or he played all, he had everything so, like, this. Number nine was the goal. Number nine. And the assist was seven. Okay. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Connor Choke scored and David Medina assisted. wearing a gray sweatshirt. Stadium, their soccer field, tennis courts. They have 16 tennis courts. It is beautiful. Beautiful. 16. 16. It is beautiful. Yellow Gatorade? Yes, please. Let's see. Oh, 
They had to pass 10 soccer fields to get to the school. <laughs> so they probably play a few games on the way to school. <laughs> yeah. Rachel's so sweet. They always have girls and girls. Yeah, girls and boys are so good. Well, they got coaches that are probably have been around a while. Yeah. And that they're as dedicated as our football coaches, mm -hmm. you know. Where we got guys on the sideline that can make this team a lot better on the football sideline. You know, I mean, well, you could play soccer, right? You play a lot of soccer. <laughs> and, but, uh, you know, it's just, but but a couple years ago, we had the, the Durriches, and they played real well. And then we had some other, uh, just think, uh, I mean, you know, Phelps was a football player, but you can't imagine him out here. He's so fast. Yeah. He'd be so good. It, it would just be like, uh, we could just loft the ball up, and he he would beat everybody. But uh, you know, it's we gotta we gotta be a football only sometimes. <laughs> and it's rough. Right now. I know. But we're definitely a uh, candy. Any leak sometimes out there, we're just bunched up. You know, we're not, we're not uh, picking our places. We're just kind of all standing around. So you play basketball and baseball, and you play basketball. You're all basketball. Okay. Well, that's. I mean, there's more injuries in basketball than anything else. <laughs> but you know, <laughs> but they don't. Uh, they don't make the charge like in other sports, but, uh, yeah, um, yeah, I tried to see if Tate was, uh, because he wrestled last year because he didn't, didn't make the eighth grade team, but, uh, then he grew like six inches, and playing goalie, uh, I think he'll be a good as far as, uh, Doing a dirty work on a basketball. You got to have somebody that's all defense somewhere. Yeah, and and he and he knows knows the game and the pick and roll and stuff. He he can really uh, sets good screens and stuff. So you know if he and I figure if you know if he wants to play, so a freshman year is is your deciding point. If you're going to play any more past that, you got to do something your freshman year. Do you guys, uh, oh, crap. Yeah, he, had, he has played soccer since he was in, uh, probably about, it's probably about since he was eight years old, and he comes back and he gives guys play goal. <laughs> but, uh. The one reason he didn't play football is because of uh, concussions. And he's had a concussion already this year playing goalie. Just getting hit with a ball. Yeah, I know uh, Trent, Trent got out of football when uh, 
play, started getting concussions. Mm -hmm. And uh, and uh, my uh, my boss at work, his son played football for Miamisburg, and he uh, he had concussions. And uh, as soon as he graduated, he I guess he went to play football at Ohio University. Go! Mm -hmm. And uh, he uh, had so many concussions and. In uh, in high school, but he uh, he went fishing with his grandpa and had a seizure while he was in the boat and fell out and drowned. He was only like 21 or 22 years old. Well, in the NFL, they or around the NFL, they made a movie. These doctors did about concussions yeah, and stuff. So and uh, my boss's son, uh, he, he his brain was donated to them to uh, test it and everything because of what happened. And, uh, and you know, we're talking somebody who, you know, was in first year of college, basically. And uh, it's just, you know, and I told my kids that. I said, I don't care what, I'll support you whatever you want to play. But, uh, you know, it's, and, uh, you know, you get practices where you're in football and, and some, of, some of you got 50 and 60 pounds on each other, you know, and, and, uh, Cause, yeah, cause cause Trent was like, dude, I, I bet I can't block uh, uh, who's a good baseball player who played third for you in baseball last year. Uh, Baker. Um, uh, no, uh, who or played Hughes. in Hughes. Hughes? Yeah, cause Hughes. Uh, Trent was like, I can't guard him, or I can't block him. He's got weight and leverage at that point over Trent. Now Trent's built like a fire plug. He can, He's uh, he's got massive calves. Wow. But uh, oh, Trent's gonna play baseball this year. He had played since eighth grade. But uh, he's gonna come out and you know um, play with tape. You know they're gonna and it'll be great. It'll just get them out on the same field because they never been the right age to play together. Yeah. And uh, I. Talk to Coach Morrison because you know on, if Trim don't make varsity, they can play together on JV or something, you know. So, and, so it'll be cool to get out to watch two kids play. Because if not, I just have to wait till I play softball. <laughs> Yeah, we, we haven't named him yet, but <laughs> are they hornets, wasp, or? Uh, I think they're hornets, actually. Okay. Almost through my uh, camera now. Oh, no. Yeah, I. It would be bad. I have to, the best way to handle hornets is a tennis racket. It's awesome. <laughs> Cause you, on, it's pretty much like the Terminator for you, because because they hover enough that you can get a good swing at them. And uh, it's kind of like on the right corner, so on, they're just trying to come in. And out. Yeah, we. I, I opened the opposite side, so I think it should be better. Well, actually, the best thing is a badminton racket because they they waffle them into many many little pieces and don't have to worry about them. <laughs> but. Uh, I'll yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, they uh Yeah, they yeah, they need to build just a foot, not like a little foot or a six inch riser yep. and just right run there. right across. These were out of Kevin Melton. I think it's Kevin Melton's garage. Did he see a theater in the house or a house that Let's go. he was working on? Get on. No. It was either him or Jimmy. Cool. One of those huh. two. I, I can't remember which one was. We got them right before the playoffs in 17. Let's make more room in here. Yeah. You know what would be great is the. 
I see them on the internet all the time, the old riverfront seats there. Yes, that was awesome. <laughs> Get somebody to... But yeah, these are nice movie chairs. Holy cow, they were great. But, uh... Oh, that's a late call. <laughs> if calls were the slum basketball, you'd be, uh, you'd have like four points scored before they <laughs> get everything under control. That's the ones that are tough right there. Tate's, Tate's been doing getting a lot of ones that he died for and blocked, but then he doesn't have help to get clear them out. And he's, you know, he's diving one way and they're kicking it on the other side of the goal after he's blocked it. But uh, I said, well, sometimes you just got to do the unexpected. I mean, if they think you, you're going to wait, stand back and wait, go up and change their angle so they can't kick it when they want to kick it. Make them kick it when you want not good. There you go. A little bit more help. That's what we need. Good job, Andrew. Oh yeah, that was my church, Spring Hill. Yeah, yeah, Spring Hill, yeah, yep. yep. And uh, the uh, Mabel's uh, Tori's cousin. She like resembles her a little bit, yes. a small version of her. And is, is Claire the girl? Get it, Red! Come on! Her and Tegan, a couple shy two years ago, I turned around. Go get it, Red! Come on! Oh, that's not Tegan. I mean, dead on. Her. When they were younger, they had long curly hair. Their facial features were the same. Go get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Oh wow! Those three started school. Nice. Let's go! They go nine to noon. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. So, get some of the flow. Yeah. 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 We played Carlisle the other day on Saturday, and 
I recorded he had over 20 shots on goal yeah, right, in the first on. half, and he stopped all of them but one. Yeah, you can fall asleep back there and you get a fast break and not be ready for it. That's a good pick. I tell Tay keep kicking like that and he'll be playing football. <laughs> They told us, they yelled at the press box one time. They said injuries and they stop before you come. They'll blow the whistle. Yeah, yeah, they'll, 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 look up, they'll give you an X. Yeah. 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 Goal, goals and injuries. Those are goals. So yesterday, I think it was yesterday. No, it was a couple ago. We're up here. The guy told us, legitimately, injuries Go get it. and goals. Come on, yep. And it was a penalty kick. Yep. Penalty kick. He's ever going to blow the whistle. I'm like, that's not an injury, and that is not a goal. Yeah. May, may have stopped the clock, and then when they plug somebody and they write it down, that's what they said. They were yelling at us. I'm like, you're not meeting your requirements. You told us in 32 minutes. <laughs> and then Coach Gross was said, hey, come on up here and do it. <laughs> yeah. Well, people start yelling down there, and they're like, it's open. Job's open. <laughs> well, double your pay. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, there you go. Uh, uh oh, 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 Throw that one. Oh, 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 oh,
number 17, Charlie Birch. Come on, Red. Let's go.